Hello, you're welcome here yeah, how to solve this nice algebra problem involving roots. The first method, that is the method one from here, let's square both sides. We have square root of 5, then inside we still have square root of 5, which is equal to 25 raised to power x. Take the square on both sides, from here we square, then on this side too we square. Then from here, this square, we cancel this square root. This gives us 5, then root 5, which is equal to this power multiplied. This gives us 25 raised to power 2x. Then also, we can repeat the process. Also, square this side. Then square this side as well. Then, this square now, we affect these two numbers. We have 5 square. Then multiply by root 5 square. Then which is equal to this power multiplied to give us 25 raised to power 4x. Then square can cancel square root. So this will give us 5 square times 5 then raised to power 1 now. Which is equal to here we can write it as 5 square. Then raised to power 4x. 5 square, same thing as 5 times 5, which is 25. Then here, apply the law of indices. If we have same base, we can have the power. So we have 5 raised to the power 2 plus 1, which is then given us this power multiplied. That's 5 raised to the power 8x. Then this gives us 5 raised to the power 3, which is equal to 5 raised to the power 8x. Then from here, the base are the same, let's equate the power so we can write 8x first, which is equal to 3. Then divide both sides by 8 from here. 8 cancel out here, then we have x equals to 3 over 8. Then let's use the second method. From here, we rewrite this what we have and separate it as root 5 multiply by. Then this will contain two roots now, then 5 equals to 25 raised to the power x. Then from here, we can write this as 5 raised to the power of, then times 5 raised to the power of, then again raised to the power half. We have it two times, which is equal to 25 raised to the power x from here. Then in the next step, this power we multiply, then we have 5 raised to the power half multiply by 5 raised to the power 1 over 4, which we can write this side as well as 5 square, then raised to the power x. Then from here, let's bring this power together. So we have 5 raised to the power half plus 1 over 4 which is equal to 5 raised to the power 2x from here. Then here, let's take these fractions together now. Then that will be 5 raised to the power s m e s t 4. 2 goes in 4, that's 2, 2 times 1, c 2 plus. Here 4 goes in 4, 1, 1 times 1, that's 1, equals to 5 raised to the power 2x. Then from here, we have 5 raised to the power 3 over 4 now equals to 5 raised to the power 2x. Then, in the same way, we have same base. Then we can equate the power. So we write, we can write 2x first, which is equals to 3 over 4 from here. Then, we can multiply both sides with 1 over 2 in order to remove this 2 here. So multiply this as 1 over 2 as well. So that 2 we cancel out here, remain x now equals to 3 times 1 is 3, then 4 times 2 is 8. And we still have x equals to 3 over 8 as well. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more exciting videos and turn the notification bell on. You can put your comments in the comment section and also give a thumbs up. Thank you. See you next class and bye for now.